so as everyone has heard coronavirus is in manhattan it's even really scary um there have been a lot of deaths and that's really upsetting uh hi everyone hi everyone hello friends city of new york is in a state of panic because i could not find hand sanitizer for the life of me coronavirus is in manhattan how exciting welcome welcome uh, make yourself at home actually do not i just talked to my parents and i told them guys listen you can't leave your room you gotta stay in the house i will bring food to you okay you stay i know you're far away from me at school like you just, i don't know why i'm talking to you like this um uh, uh, uh yeah i go through periods of like calm everything's calm everything's cool everything we're good people are freaking out i'm like guys 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 we're good wash your hands i'm talking to you margaret here's what happened just got out of class i'm like oh i should go pick up some hand sanitizers i run my butt all over the upper west side literally every single store i go into i'm like hi like i'm looking for hand sanitizer every single one we're sold out we're sold out we're sold out but then i go through periods where i'm like it's spreading fast <laughs> I've been working from home since yesterday. <laughs> it's only been a day and a half, but I'm going crazy. Let me just tell you about where I went. CVS, Walgreens, little random hardware stores around where I live. Some people have asked me why I'm working from home. Number one is that I commute for 35 minutes usually, and my body is not genetically made for these type of weather changes. Um, I go to the office and be coughing because I don't think anyone would like that. <laughs> uh, and then in class today, my health economics class, we decided to have a whole class about it, which, you know, was informative. But, you know, once it comes into the class, that's when I feel like the danger hits. You're kind of like, everywhere go online completely sold out online and you can go like look for in store and put in your zip code the whole manhattan area i swear to god there must be no hand sanitizers left i have these um go Clorox wipes and i have like five of them in the beginning of the semester i had a respiratory <laughs> problem which was not the coronavirus i actually was diagnosed with um adult asthma uh, this is my inhaler i call him steve then the saving grace that is morton williams if you know you know i went in there and one of the workers was just unpacking a case that just came in so i got oh, i can barely hold them all Three things of hand sanitizer. I'm not even kidding. I feel like it might be gone by now. I feel like Manhattan is just in a frenzy. Uh... The number of people on this tiny island, like it's really gross to think about. A two Purell. Huge thing of vitamin C. Jess and Margaret are both very into their uh, hand sanitizers, which is good. And I will go buy some hand sanitizers. For now, I want to show you my sweets contraption. You walk into the suite, you do a little, a little, a little puff puff, not puff puff, fast. <laughs> but I can't, I can't put it on the other hand. This is just, you know, what happens when there's a friggin' pandemic going around. And also last weekend, I went home to Rhode Island. Come back a week later, confirmed case of coronavirus in Rhode Island. Wash your hands a lot and wipe down your surfaces. Don't touch your face. Any other tips? I'm leaving the bathroom. Just wash my hands as you all should be doing. Cover your cough. Peace and love, people. But Margaret, if you were not able to find Clorox wipes and hand sanitizer, or vitamin C, 
um, let me know. I will mail these to you. And yes, and then you go like this. This is how you do the hand sanitizer. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. that. Um, did I have to do that after I just washed my hands? No, but precaution. Wash your hands.